What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Danielle, and this is Dress Danielle, a channel for any person who styles a little more unisex. Whether you're gay, straight, lesbian, bisexual, trans, queer, androgynous, just a tomboy, gender neutral, gender fluid, or anywhere else on the LGBTQIABCDEFG spectrum, then you're in the right place. Because every week, I'll give you ideas and inspiration that'll help you look clean. If that sounds interesting to you, then keep on watching. Today's video is five outfits that you should wear this summer. Okay, starting things off with outfit number one. This is a crew neck t-shirt with some denim shorts. Everything I'm wearing here is men's besides the shoes, which are women's. You're going to want to shop in all sections. And if you want to know why, comment below and I'll do a video on that later. But this is a muscle tee from Top Man and muscle tees are nice because they hug you right on the bicep. On my neck is a small black chain I may have gotten from H&M. Moving down, the belt is from All Saints and the shorts are from H&M. On my feet are sneakers from the women's section of Old Navy. And finally, the watch is leather and it's from Jeffrey Dean. Next is a variation of outfit number one. This is also a crew neck t-shirt with some denim shorts. But this time the shirt is from a brand called Essentials and the shorts are from the women's section of Levi's. Around my neck I've got a dog tag chain from Things Remembered and on my wrist I've got a watch from the women's section of H&M. Moving down to my feet I've got some Chuck Taylors with some high socks and I like Chuck Taylors if you're gonna get dirty and possibly be in large crowds. You can throw on a hat for a sporty look. I prefer baseball caps. A good way to elevate the previous two outfits is to swap out the denim shorts for some chino shorts and then tuck in the shirt. This shirt is also from Essentials and the shorts are from Next. Both are men's. On the wrists, I've got the watch that's from the women's section of H&M. Now what I did with this next outfit is show you how the previous outfit is very versatile. Here all I did was throw on a shirt over it and it just gave it a different look. Nice pattern, kind of switch it up and add some more color in there. You can keep it open or you can button up which gives you a different look as well. And then you also have the option to take off the undershirt and you know, feel sexy if you want. This would be nice for the beach or you know, somewhere that you're gonna be really hot. This shirt is from Armani Exchange and the shorts again are from Next. And if you are going to the beach, you don't want to wear those white sneakers so you can do some sandals. These are Birkenstocks. And here's another look at the outfit again with the white shirt in between and the white sneakers. Moving on to another outfit, I've got some cropped pants from the women's section of H&M. And then up top, I've got a Hanes t-shirt from the boys section. And this one I tucked in because I also wanted it to look clean and sophisticated. And here I'm about to put on some black aviator sunglasses. On my wrist is the same Jeffrey Bean watch and on the feet are the Old Navy white sneakers. Now this shirt I decided to roll up the sleeves myself because they didn't come that way and actually the way they came they were a little too long. That will oftentimes make your whole outfit look messy so you do want to roll up the sleeves if that's the case for you. And here's a closer look at the white sneakers from Old Navy paired with the pants. You can take the outfit up a notch by swapping out the white sneakers and the watch. I swapped out the white sneakers for some suede loafers from the women's section of H&M. Next outfit is a good option if you're going to need to dress up but the event is probably going to be outdoors. It's dressy enough to pass but it's still pretty casual and you know fits that tomboy s vibe that we like. The shirt is a nice summer color and the shorts are not necessarily denim, not necessarily chino, so they're kind of in between which is why I like them. This is a woman's shirt from Calvin Klein and the shorts are also women's and it's from a brand called Artisan New York. On the feet, I've got the white sneakers from Old Navy. And on the wrist, I've got the watch from the women's section of H&M. You can see it's pretty versatile. 
Last but not least, we've got what I like to call the Cuban poppy outfit. And this is a fedora hat from Express paired with a women's 100% linen shirt from Parisian Works. And when you wear this type of shirt, you want to make sure that you unbutton at least the three top buttons to give, you know, a nice, cool, sexy look. And this one I did pair with some shorter shorts, but I only felt that was necessary because the shirt was already oversized. This outfit would be a good option to have if you were going on vacation. On my wrist is another watch I got from H&M and the dog tag chain is around my neck. Moving down to the feet, here I've got some suede slip-ons, but you can also buy some canvas slip-ons. Those will work really well as well because the canvas will go with the linen material. Once again, you can open up the shirt if you're on the beach, if that's your type of style, or if not, you can always throw a tank top underneath. Let's quickly recap. First, we've got the crew neck t-shirt with some denim shorts and white sneakers. Swap out the sneakers for some Chuck Taylors and a hat. Swap out the denim shorts for some chino shorts and tuck in the shirt. Put an over shirt over that outfit and add some color and pattern. Take off the shirt if you're at the beach. Take a t-shirt and tuck it into some cropped pants with some white sneakers. And swap out the white sneakers if you want to dress it up for some suede loafers. Take a colorful dress shirt and pair them over some white shorts and white sneakers. And finally, try bringing out some linen this summer with a fedora hat and some slip-ons. That's it for me today. If you like what you saw, then go ahead and leave me a thumbs up. And if you want to be notified the next time I drop a video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. And if you have any type of questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Even if it's just a video idea that you want me to do. I have a lot more coming to help you get dressed. But for now, it's peace and love. And remember, stay fresh.